Yoga, coordination and relaxation for pelvis, lower back and legs. Part 2 First of all, we lay two balls under our pelvis. Then we start gently to move our pelvis to the left and to the right side. So the pelvis and the lower back can relax and sink towards the floor. Second step, we start to let the left or right leg fall to one side, to the outside, from the knee. And then we start to let fall the knee, the whole leg, to the inside, through gravity. Starting position, you place two balls under the pelvis close to the sit bones so the lower back can sink gently towards the floor. Then you start gently to move both legs to the left and to the right side. Second step. We let fall one of the legs, left or right, to the outside and you start the movement from the knee. So the weight can easily work on the leg and the pelvis can relax. Third step. You let the knee fall to the inside of the leg. So the gravity can work and the leg can completely relax together with the pelvis. These both movements relaxing and lengthening the inside and the outside of the pelvis muscles. Now it is your turn. Put two soft balls on your pelvis. Close your eyes and listen to the instructions. You start with placing two soft balls under your pelvis. When you place two balls under your pelvis, please be sure that the two balls are close to the sit bones and a little bit far from each other. So the lower back can sink towards the floor and the spine between the left and the right sacrum can relax. Then you start gently to move the left and the right leg through gravity to the left and to the right side like a boat on the ocean water. Through this gently movement, the, your whole pelvis can relax and your legs get loose. Please do this in your own time. When you feel comfortable, then you start to let one leg, your choice, fall to the left outside or to the right outside. The movement starts from the knee, so you let your left or right leg fall from the knee towards the floor through gravity. To this movement you can relax the outside muscles of your pelvis.
again, you come back to the starting position and you lay, let one of your legs fall to the inside. The movement starts again from the knee. To get the greatest range of movement, you like to place the foot on a different part of the floor so you have a bigger range of movement to the inside. Now you have practiced and experienced the soft and gently movement. When you are practicing this movement every day, you will experience an easiness in the outside and inside rotation. So your movements of the leg will get more, legs will get more easily and light. The secret of the movement is the gravitation and the joy and love towards any movement you do.